Charlie. Charlie. He's my co-host. But here, this is, a, this is my back catalog. As you can see, I have a lot of games here. They either stopped playing or I forgot I had. So, let's get started. Siege. I had Siege for a while. I, I don't know, I stopped playing. But um, it seems like the community is going strong. People are still playing this game. And it's just, uh, I just stopped playing it. I don't know why. Um, I couldn't get my buddies to really get on and play it with me. But yeah, that's uh, Rainbow Six Siege. Okay. Of course, Cyberpunk. I beat that. I haven't um, beat the DLC, the new expansion. But, you know, I enjoyed the game, nevertheless. This is probably rare. You know? <laughs> Uh, Destiny, of course. This is the first Destiny. Yes, I have the disc version, and it's kind of funny to see that because it's basically free to play now. But yeah, it came a long way. I don't think I've ever played this. Um, not even once. Maybe I got it because I thought it was going to be like the Genesis game. But uh, this has not increased my system. <laughs> Check this out. I actually have the Fortnite disc. Disc. It was an early access package. That's crazy. Yeah. Look how far. This I haven't opened up. It's still plastic. So I'll be getting my joints clearance. For the get good community, I got that. Didn't finish it though. We was on this game pretty tough, me and my buddies. It's too bad because the I think the server's going to be taken down pretty soon. So, I didn't get a chance to uh, play the DLC with the Terminators and stuff. But I beat it. But I didn't completely beat it. Alright, that's one pile. This might be a rarity, but um, it's a, pretty much a battle royale with um, all your favorite anime characters and stuff. I used to have it on the PlayStation 3, but I had to get it for the 4. I remember playing it pretty tough for the 3, but I had to get it for my collection. This joint right here. Yeah, I bought it. I was part of the hype train. Now, the traversal is pretty awesome in this game. And that's top notch. But the story and the hub city, ugh, atrocious. But, you know, for what it's worth, they, they did give it a good try. I was hoping they would give it the um, cyberpunk treatment. But no, that hasn't happened. Of course, we got the Ultra Ninja Storm 4. I was never good at this game, but it's part of my collection. Borderlands 3, I think I fired it up once. Got put in the back burner for some reason. None of my buddies picked it up, and you know, it was just, just ended up being part of the collection. Left Alive. I really tried to like this game, but it, it, it's really overly difficult for no reason. It's part of another series, but I'll, I'll, I'll put it up there. Like, right now, it, it leaves me. I don't really remember where it came from. But no. I don't, I don't recommend this. What do you think, Charlie? Do you recommend it? Dreams. Now, the bad thing is that, um, I think they're gonna close the server. I think you can still play the games, but, um, it was, I feel like it's a missed opportunity. This game is one of those games where people can be creative and you always have something to play. And it doesn't really go away. Like, a lot of creative minds really shined in this, um, this game do some gameplays on this one right here think of like a uh, left for dead but with like medieval weapons and stuff like that that's pretty much what this game is it's pretty cool so i don't think i played this one it's in my collection but i have, have not fired it up i love when they say oh the ranger all right the expansion part i haven't beat that yet try to get my buddies to play okay of course back for blood the Left 4 Dead vibe. Of course, you know, I got to, man, come on now. Of course I got to get this. And of course I didn't finish it. <laughs> I think I stopped on, uh, right after, uh, Goku died. And that's way in the beginning. But, you know, oh boy, this is shameful. Okay, of course, Jedi Fallen Order. I got pretty far, but I didn't beat it. Ooh, this game. If you don't like spiders, I don't recommend you play this. That one boss, the creeps, 
it's pretty brutal gameplay. Just Devil May Cry. I think I played a little bit of it. Didn't finish it. I played the hell. I, you know what? This game adds a special place in my heart because I was going through a dark spot in my life. And this game was my medication. It really was. A lot of good and bad memories. But this met, this game really pulled me through. Chef kiss for this one. Awesome game. Alright, Mortal Kombat. You gotta have Mortal Kombat in your collection. I'm not feeling the new one. This is where they went up and it's going down. This is my personal opinion. Yeah, it might be crazy, but this was it. This was good for me. This is Mafia. That was dope. If you like good fellas and all that, the mob vibe, this is a good one. Okay, yeah, I got had Watch Dogs Legions. I think it's a it's not a bad game. I do like the concept that you could recruit anyone, like an old lady. <laughs> Your old lady choking people out doing all kind of stuff the gimmick was probably the downfall multiplayer is fire on this you know if you get some buddies to come play with this game which is good i remember when red box was giving video games they uh <laughs> when they whenever they were selling them marked down to get rid of them they were selling them pretty cheap so that's why this one is the red box and it's resident evil 2 Death Stranding. I have not played this at all. It's, look how dusty it is. I have not played this game. And 2's coming out. So I'm going to have to fire this up. Maybe do a long gameplay of it. And of course, Magnus Opus The Division. One of my favorite games. A lot of people be um, going in on The Division, but you know, I platinum this joint. So you can tell I played the hell out of it. Awesome game. I got two. <laughs> Now, there's, there's improvements from part one, but when it comes to the best one, it is, it is, one is the best one, it is. I have great memories with that. But two is still good, too. I, I enjoy two currently. They have a three, you know I'm playing it. And I'm waiting for the, um, what the hell is it called? Um, um, some lands. Fallout is an awesome series, the vibe, listening to the music, going in and, and finding gear and, and using the crazy weapons, making stuff. It's just, it, the whole vibe is perfect. If you made an MMO out of it, it seemed like it would be better, right? Nah, <laughs> one of those, it was good on paper type things, but I still like it. It's kind of like a drunk uncle, you know, you love them, but you know, they just don't do things right. And that's what it seems like to me. Ghost Recon, good times. We had a sniping competition shoot people it feels good the driving was a little off when you're in there with your buddies and clearing things out calling your shots that's when the game really shined i beat the mess out of it i'm not didn't like the um the last battle part press square press x you know i mm -mm, no nah. the combat was tight the enemies leveled up when you when they killed you and they got harder so they learned off you very challenging and very satisfying combat. If you played Infamous, Infamous 1 and 2, then you know what type of game this is, Second Son. Same vibe, open world fun, you can use your abilities and stuff. I will say this though, every time you fought a concrete guy, they were hard, but when you got the concrete ability, it was trash. Became an Elden Lord. For those type of games, to get good games, this didn't feel like one to me. When I died, I felt like it was my fault. You see those little videos, people's punching the screen, throwing controllers and stuff. I didn't do that. Yeah, uh, Destiny 2, of course, I got part two. It's crazy because people that joined in, that got the game free, this story is not in it anymore. The, they got the whole story out, so everybody don't know what's going on. I think that's kind of messed up, but, you know, that's how it is. They change things, and they take things out. Fallout 4, good times. They should have had multiplayer on this instead of having the companions so i think it was a missed opportunity right there this one right here godzilla this is a rare game now, i've been a long time godzilla fan for for years i was so happy when i found this online because you could download it digitally but i want the physical copy of the game if you played river city ransom that's pretty much the vibe of this but it's more up to date the main characters are in there too they're boyfriends and these are lovable characters the combat is pretty deep if you pretty much played river city you know what to expect from this 
It's a good time. It was worth the money. Oh. I'm a little ashamed of myself. I didn't finish this, Kingdom Hearts 3. I'm going to. Definitely going to finish this up pretty soon. What Kingdom Heart was your favorite? A lot of people like two. Okay, Mercenary Wings. Uh, this is more like a strategy game. Because it's very hard to find that Final Fantasy Tactics fix. But yeah, it, it did scratch that itch. Now, this one I couldn't play. Because the server wouldn't let me play. So, it might be a dead game. Servers might be down. Okay, days. That type of combat was kind of okay, you know. You kind of left stranded and you got to get your materials while people are in the same situation as you. These games are kind of hard to um, keep playing. And another game that's coming up is kind of the same thing too. People kind of cannibalizing each other just to get up. Rest. I played a little bit of it and I maybe I need to get back into it. They say like you have your own server or you join non-threatening server. Generation Zero. I like the vibe of the game. I liked how when you saw a big robot, it, it felt like a real battle, and you was, it was always loot. Loot was abundant in this game. This one didn't have a cover, but it's uh, Berserk and the Band of the Hawk. Think of like uh, Dynasty Warriors, how it's just you against like a crowd of people, and you gotta chop through them. You'll have a special gauge, and you, you can do a big special move. That's pretty much how it is, and I'm a sucker for Berserk. Looking up the manga, and I have not been disappointed. I highly recommend it. It's too bad um, the creator passed away. No rest in peace. But, you know, Berserk is one of my favorites. Outriders, if you're into looter shooters, is not bad. At times it does feel a little generic, but I've actually beat this with my buddies. Haven't beat the new expansion. I actually like this game. Dare to say it's my favorite Assassin's Creed game. I played Black Flag and I, I didn't finish Black Flag. That's what people talk about now. Black flag this, black flag that. No, this was my joint. Gundam Breaker 3, Breaker Edition. You know, those little Gundam sets that you put together. Imagine that you're able to play as the little toy and you can break pieces off and, and add it to your, your body and you collect pieces as you fight. Bloodstain. A lot of uh, Symphony of the Night vibes from this game. Awesome game. Didn't beat it. I need to. This game is kind of like Symphony of Night 2 as well. No Man's Sky. Highly recommend it if you like space travel and discover new life forms and, and planets. You can name everything. You can, name, you can discover a planet, name everything down to the rock, down to the creatures, everything you find. It has that scanning mechanic that kind of reminds me of uh, Metroid Prime games. Red Dead 2, awesome game. And here it is, <laughs> Avengers, Marvel's Avengers. For what it's worth, it wasn't a bad game. The story was pretty good. I think they bit off more than they could chew. Another game I have not fired up and played. I heard about it and I picked it up. I saw gameplay of this game and I thought it was pretty cool because you can actually ride on a broom. You see the guy on a broom, so you can get your Harry Potter on. The traversal was pretty cool. Risk and Rain, not bad. I actually got immersed in this pretty deeply. I, I played it for a while and I didn't realize how long I was playing the game. I actually beat this game. I have not played this. It's pretty much like a strategy game. You gotta get your skills up because these boys will make you look stupid. Another game I have not played, Street Fighter. It has the original Street Fighter. All that on there. Good times. That was all of my PlayStation 4 games. Now, time to get my PlayStation 5 games. Skull and Bones, of course I got it. I mentioned it in my videos. I have a love-hate thing going on with this game. There's things I like and there's things I don't really care for. I got this as a Christmas gift from my buddies. And we hop on once in a while. Hell Divers. But yeah, this is my back catalog. Which game would you like to see me play? Which game was your favorite? And which game you never heard of let me know in the comments and thanks for watching what do you think charlie charlie what do you think hmm? me too my life this is my life it's mine to own this is my life less with the microphone this is my life you need to get yours. This is my life. Death's gonna knock at your door. This is my life. I got so much to give.